What's good, y'all, man? Look, I'm finna give y'all a story time for real, for real. You know what I mean? Look, I'm from Chicago. You know what I'm saying? Why 100, 121st Emerald? And there was one time. There was one time. You know what I'm saying? It's nice outside. We out there chilling, man. Out there kicking it, playing basketball. You know what I'm saying? And some dudes, a couple of dudes walk past, man. Two dudes walk, walk down the block. You know what I'm saying? And one of them like, man, I should hit y'all pockets. You feel me? I should hit y'all pockets. And I'm like, nigga, hit who pockets? And my homeboy, you know what I'm saying? Little man, he like, man, hit who pockets? You feel me? So, um, that nigga walk in the crib. He walk off smooth in the mouth. He ain't run. He ain't do none of that. So the nigga walk in, he walk. Walk upstairs and shit. Go in the crib. You know what I'm saying? We get to finish playing ball. While he walked off, I'm playing ball with the, with the other guys and shit. And so, this nigga come back out the crib. Folks, I swear to God, folks was like he was in the motherfucker. Like he, like he nigga went to school for shooting. You feel me? You feel me? So, this nigga, if y'all know how the block is, you know what I'm saying? There was a one block on our house that had like flowers. They they had like a, down that garden, like a, like nice flowers and shit. So, this nigga kneel on the, on the sidewalk. When he on the sidewalk, and he kneeled down. Folks get the black, back, back, back. So these niggas get the returning fire, but imagine you. They down there by the tracks. We stayed by the tracks. We They down there by the tracks, and there was this big old tree. I'm talking about big, wide tree. So these niggas, they leaning out. So when they get to shooting, they get shooting at each other. I take off. I take off. I, I hit the gangway. I see one of the homies. I hear the bullets. I hear the bullet. I hear the bullet hit the gate. Boom. Hit hit one of the guys in the hip. Uh. I jump over him. When he hit the ground, I jumped over him. You know what I'm saying? It seemed like the nigga was shooting at me. It seemed like the nigga was shooting at me, though. Homeboy, he on that side of the street. My nigga on that side of the street. And I'm running on the other side of the street going to the gangway on the side I stayed on. You know what I'm saying? The house where we be hanging out at. So I cut down that way. Bam. I jump over him. Imagine my homeboy across, across the street shooting too. He over there shooting at the niggas. So he, I see him. Bam. Jump over. I check myself out. Make sure I ain't shot. You know what I'm saying? I, man, I ain't hear that Imagine he got hit in the hip. He leaking. I'm talking about leaking from the hip, man. Imagine you, my brother, down at the crib. So he, after everything going on, he come down and he take end up taking homeboy to the to the hospital. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? He saved his life because if he would have waited on the ambulance, he said he would have bled out. You know what I'm saying? Because he was like going in and out. My brother said he was going in and out while he was driving him to the hospital. You know what I'm saying? That's one of the crazy stories, man. Living in the hundreds, living in Chicago, man. You know what I'm saying? Nigga told us robbing us. It was like five, six of us outside. And it was only two of them. And you know what I'm saying? You told us, so you robbing us? We didn't get robbed. One of the guys got hit. But, you know what I'm saying? Nigga made it through. Made it through. Story time.